Lori here. Welcome or welcome back. I am here with an update. I successfully completed my January fitness challenge. I worked out every day for the month of January for a total of 31 days. Your girl did not miss a beat. I actually had three other targets I wanted to hit as well, which is taking my vitamins every day, meditating every day, and journaling every day. I successfully completed all four tasks every day with the exception of the 29th, which was a Saturday. I fell asleep. <laughs> the plan was to go upstairs and journal, have a cup of tea, and meditate. Well, I meditated on my pillow that evening, so I got half of those tasks done. But I consider January a huge success, which leads me to my next challenge that my husband actually suggested, which is no sugar February. So we are doing no simple carbs or sugar and no processed sugar this month of February. Please feel free to join us. Last challenge, I had a really good friend of mine join us from Kansas City. My cousin in Detroit joined us. Of course, I was doing it with my sisters and my mom. So it was really fun to have other people join in. It was just a lot of fun. And speaking of Georgia, I'm actually headed down to Georgia to do a bit of neighborhood scouting. We have been thinking about a move south and I just been and I've been wanting to get away and that's a perfect place for me to get away and just have a look around. I often go to Georgia and it always feels good to go back so that's what I will be doing of course I'm bringing you along and I'm gonna be sharing some some home tours with you and just some scouting some neighborhoods and I'm gonna meet up with a few friends and family while I'm there right now I'm about to run out I have to pick up some dry cleaning that I dropped off a couple weeks ago that I actually want to have for the trip I also need to run by Michaels I started my February calendar but I kind of messed it up and I didn't have everything I wanted I was gonna just wing it and just go with the hodgepodge calendar but I said no we're gonna do this right I'm going to Michaels and I'm getting some materials batteries running low so that's why I'm talking fast we got to get out thank you so much walk I have a little apple I am famished I didn't get to grab lunch so I have to hurry do my walk get back start dinner make sure homework's all done and then start on my calendar start over and the usual journal and gratitude entry let's do this Hey, so I am back from my walk, feeling good, feeling great. Get ready to grab a bite to eat. I'm gonna keep it simple tonight. I'm just gonna grab a pre-made salad that my babe picked up from Trader Joe's. I'm gonna throw a bit of textured protein over the top of it and call it. And when it comes to textured protein and things like that, I have a little bit of it. I'm not big on getting my protein from full meats and stuff. I prefer to get it directly from one source, whether that's a bean or some peanut butter or some yogurt or cheese, you know, that goes through a production. And, um, but cheese has other nutrients that I love, which is like the B12 that's naturally occurring in milk and, and animal products. I'm not huge on the faux meat wave. I, I'm not into the impossible burgers and all of that. And I can't believe it's not meat stuff. Like <laughs> it's not really my thing. Occasionally I'll have it if I'm craving a little more texture, but in terms of eating it regularly, I don't, I don't really do it. I the most the most I probably eat it is maybe twice out of the month maybe
All right, it's all done. Now all I have to do is add my heart for today. I didn't exercise yesterday, but I did do my meditation and my gratitude journaling. And I took my vitamins, but I took exercise off. So I will give myself a heart for that. I think I earned it. What do you guys think? Did I earn a heart or no? <laughs> Three quarters of a heart. Anyway, that is it. And now all I need to do is write in some posts, which I will be posting this one a little bit late. This will be going up today or this evening. And then I'll be posting again on Saturday and Sunday. My goal is to post every Wednesday and the weekend. I'm thinking about more like Wednesday, maybe Wednesday. I was thinking maybe Monday, Wednesday. No, Sunday's not going to work. Let me see. Sunday, maybe Tuesday. Maybe I'll do Tuesday, Thursday, Sunday. Let me think about it. All right. Calendar is done. Workout is done. Dinner is done. Kitchen's done. Kids are in bed where I'm about to join them. I'm about to go to bed myself. This was a lot of fun. I just made five horizontal lines and then six vertical lines evenly straight across the paper. Then, of course, I wrote it in February in the days of the month. I'm getting ready to wind down for the evening. I hope this calendar helps serve as inspo in case you want to try it out. And what I like to do is I make a big list of things I want to get done. Anything that's rolling around in my mind. And then I break it down into smaller parts with you know, the most pressing stuff coming first and, and then anything that could wait a little bit, I push it out farther in the month and I just try to chip away at the main list. I call it the main list. So I have all this stuff that I need to get done and I'll just pull from the list as I'm able to complete them. And so then that way, you know, I don't feel as, I won't say overwhelmed because I don't feel overwhelmed. I will feel like I'm getting things done and completed. I'm checking things off the list. And it helps me because if I write it down, I'll get it done. And chances are, if I don't write it down, then I'll just keep putting it off. So I love checking things off of a list. I don't know if you're like that too, but I love to just check it off. Also, I was able to shoot some photos today for my website. I'm so excited. I got back on that. It's taken longer than I thought it would. There's just so many little tiny pieces and things you have to do with building a website. It's kind of uh, tedious, but just little small details. I like some details and I like setting up websites, but it's just the time factor, which I don't have a ton of. <laughs> but anyway, I hope you enjoy this vlog. I will see you again very soon. Probably the next time you see me, will I be in Georgia? No, I won't be in Georgia yet. Or will I? Maybe I'll do a pack with me. You guys let me know.